Hey guys, it's Wanda and welcome to Crazy Days. Today I'm just going to give you a little brief photo, mini clips of what I did last week for my birthday. I didn't do a whole lot. Mainly I got clips of Danny. Um, I did a little bit of canning because we did get some meat and I had to can some, but I didn't even put that in the clip. Um, what else did I do? Oh, Danny cooked breakfast every morning. We stayed at the cabin uh, every night. He cooked a steak on my birthday, so I got a steak and some um, pineapple. And he worked on chairs for the um, cabin. He worked on the fireplace of the cabin. We're getting ready to put stone in, which that's supposed to be my birthday present is stone for the fireplace. It won't be here till October, so it's a little late. Um, but it's going to be exciting when I get stoned on that fireplace. That's the one thing that Danny wanted done first, and it's one of the last things we're doing. Um, we also stayed at the pier a little bit. We didn't fish. We just went out and fed them and watched the fish. Uh, we sat in our glider a little bit. We worked in the greenhouses a time or two. Uh, we painted on the third greenhouse. We're getting it ready so that we can use it this uh, winter. Um, what else did we do? Danny plowed the garden, the peas. I paid bills, things like that. Cooked a little bit, cleaned up a little, that sort of thing. But I didn't hurt myself. I did not get on the internet. I kind of stayed off. And y'all, it was kind of nice not to be on the internet all the time. I know that sounds weird, but it it is nice not to have to just constantly be doing something. Uh, we did have to do Etsy orders so that was something so we worked but we didn't we didn't work hard and I'm gonna show you at the end what I got a little special something that I found that I wanted and Danny bought it for me and so I kind of got the cart before the horse y'all stay tuned I'll talk to you later oh we did stay outside the beginning we stayed outside a lot at night, and Danny talks to the owls. Yeah, he talks to the owls. It's fun, though. We enjoy the nature. We enjoy watching things and seeing how things do outside, and um, that was part of it, just chilling. So, guys, I hope you enjoy a little bit of Wanda's week without the Internet and just having fun. Thank you guys from Crazy Days. It is my candy corn cabin, ain't it, baby? After all, it's going to end up being that. 
I didn't choose the color. <laughs> but I, knew, I do. I knew I had to. I think it's the the right color though. It's a pumpkiny color, but once it dries, it looks really good. It'll match all your stuff on the inside. You can actually take your bowls in there and put them up against it. And... <laughs> the coffee cups, the plates. Everything. It will cool. probably all match. Today is the 22nd of September, the day after my birthday, and I didn't get what I expected for my birthday. Guess what? Ta-da! Baby chicks. And they're rowdy. Now we, we were told they were rowdy by the lady in the post office because she said she's already peeked at them. We can peek up in there and look. Their eyes say browns. Yep. They weren't supposed to ship till tomorrow, so we weren't expecting them for a couple of days, and these are pretty good-sized little chicks. Yep. So, what what you got to do today? Well, it knocks all of our plans out because we thought they were coming tomorrow, and I was going to plow the garden, put out lime, and do all these kinds of things. Now I got to go home and fix up a place to put these because it's supposed to be down to 49 to 50 degrees tonight, and that's way too cold for these baby chicks. So now I get to go build a place for the baby chicks to be. But in your defense, we did get, we the, did little, get the little hutch. We got the little chicken hutch. We huh. got them from Mount Healthy Hatcheries. So. And we got the building and we've got it all painted and you're gonna use it just till these get up big enough that they can go somewhere else. Well, until they feather out good and we can actually get them where they don't have to be kept under a light all the time, you know, so. Um, They're headed to their new fancy little house. Headed to the fancy little chicken house. Well, the baby chicks get to go to their new home. In our new cage, he's got plastic all around and You're in, introducing them to water to start with. Four babies. Pecking each other. Look at that, how mean. No, you can't come out the door. He's gonna find the food first. There you go, look at there. Didn't take them long. All 12 of them healthy. Actually, there's 13 of them, I think. I'll recount. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13 of them. I sent an extra one. Wow.
Danny's telling me I got my cart before the horse, right? She did. She got the cart ahead of the horse. Let's see. I found this and I told Danny I wanted it, so we came back to look at it again. It's in really good shape. It's a little cart, but the ends are in good shape. Everything, he's gonna obviously redo it. There's a couple of things I need to redo. We gotta see if we can locate the rubber for the, uh, for the wheels, because it's gone off of that wheel. And yeah. In all the pictures, this has a cushion on the seat, so I probably would have to either see if they make them still or we can buy one, have somebody make a cushion. Some of these need replacing, so he thought he would replace these. He has uh, oak in the barn that he can replace these. We want to repaint it, but overall, my cart... I think it's okay. I mean, I'm looking at it. It doesn't look like it's in that bad of shape. A couple of things need rebuilding, you know, but uh, uh, we've got the original here to make one out of. So I've got draw knives and all that kind of stuff. We can uh, we can remake this right here. And my goal is I want it to sit in front of our one day, hopefully, new barn, right? We'll see. Um, I just think it would be awesome to take pictures with have fun with, things like that. And it's not gonna be the red looking color. This is what it was painted originally, but we'll paint it a different color and have it sitting. No horse, okay? We're not getting a horse. No, no, no horses. That's We're not bucket. getting horses. That's a bucket with a hole in the bottom of it. Uh, but I'm getting the cart before the horse, but I'm not getting a horse. This is gonna be for decorations type thing, putting plants at, that sort of thing, taking pictures. It's not to get a horse. Just so y'all say, Wanda's getting a horse. No, no, no. no Wanda no, ain't no, getting no horse. We don't need a horse. No, that's the last thing we need. The wheels all still roll real well. To be wood on, I mean, that's, that's, it's a good true wheel. It's not warped bad. It's, uh, Everything is real smooth, not rough. Yeah, it pulls real easy. I mean, virtually it weighs absolutely nothing. I mean, I mean it doesn't weigh anything. I mean, you, you just... so it wasn't hard for a horse to pull it. Oh no! I mean, me, I, I, guess, I mean, I just got it resting on my fingers. I mean, it, it's nothing, and I'm on rocks with it. And see, it, I just got it resting on some two fingers. It weighs absolutely nothing. So it made it really easy for a horse. Oh, to a pull. horse, he didn't even know there was anything behind him. He just. Gallivanting with his own weight. Home, James. Oh, that weighs absolutely nothing. Yeah, that, without that rubber on it there, that metal is uh, digging into the rocks. Now, once it's got the rubber on it, rolls really easy. The one with just the metal uh, buries up in the rocks. None at all. All right. So your uh, cub could... Uh, a horse wouldn't even know it's behind him. Your cub could pull it really easily. Oh, a lawnmower could pull that with no problem. Mm -hmm. 